Hello everyone, how goes it on this, well, not so fine Friday here, it's been raining all day, but hopefully it's fine where you are. Braxar, hello. Okay, just making sure I don't have double microphone like a nuclear race the other day. A6, how's it going? Guy digs holes, howdy doody. Spraz, how's it going? New stream time, yeah, I'm going back to Friday streams. Uh, my Sundays have just been... It came to a head last, no, I guess two weeks ago, when the Joint Operations Multiplayer event. Well, first of all, no one came, which was for the better, but I guess some update came out because like, I could just not host a game all of a sudden when it was fine before then. So uh, then we played some Halo, which was fun, but I got so frustrated. And then it's like, it's always on like a Sunday evening when you like gotta like cook dinner afterwards and get ready for the week, so. It was always very hectic, so I'm glad to be going back to Friday, I know. It's not the best time for the European viewers, and it doesn't mean there won't be any streams on the weekend going forward, but this will be, this stream, will, this, the, uh, the submarine stream will be, will be Fridays going forward from now, just, uh, for my sanity and enjoyment. <laughs> <clears throat> Dark Age, how's it going? Been raining here all week. I was sorry to hear that guy digs holes. So yeah, let's do it. Uh, we got I got killed last time. That sucked. I wanted to see if I couldn't change the submarine and ship stats independently of one another for 68 campaign, and it's probably like it's probably possible, but not in five minutes. <laughs> so we're gonna do normal difficulty for today. So one step down, casual, I guess you could say. Uh, for some reason, in like the configuration files, it's like easy, normal, hard, expert, but then in like in here they call it like casual realistic different different names for it but uh yeah the surface ships are a bit too op and 68 in my opinion I find the submarine difficulty but the surface ships should be more or less dumb to my presence i feel like but anyway let's get on with it then oh i need to do a random random number generator hold on a second here all right, we got our little random random selector here. We got all the different hull types that we can pick from. Nautilus, six skipjacks, five skipjacks. That's right, correct. Permits, sturgeons. So let's do it. All right then, sixty-nine <laughs> random number. <laughs> all right, drum roll, please. Sturgeon. Oh, there you go, the old stoigen. Ah, the first time I did this when it was off stream, I, it picked Nautilus. So I was like, is it gonna do it? But no, it did not. So, the easiest boat it could be, but the, the random number is king. Stat. Save Oon. Uh, now just overwrite it. There's nothing to remember from that. Oh, look at that guppy. Okay, yeah, that's, that's the configuration the Torsk is in. So, yeah, I got this fancier one. Sturgeon, accept. Oh, we got the Sturgeon, the 637, okay. <clears throat> Why no Narwhal? There is no Narwhal yet in 68. I don't think. Was there? I don't know. I thought that was a 70s boat. 26 knots. Did I read right? You did read right, indeed. Same reactor between... Skipjack permit and sturgeon, and of course the boats kept getting bigger and draggier, so speed goes down. It's taking out the lead boat of every class. <laughs> All right, it's going to be some submarine stuff to get through here. Green 11. Not green 311, but green 11. What do we got? Yeah, this is a pretty solid mix. I think, do we carry more than a permit? Maybe. Maybe not. Very similar, if not. Alright, green 11, let's do it. First, I'm just gonna save so I don't have to go through that trivially short 
campaign starting screen thing again here. Uh, we'll just hang out right here in 12. Try and see some stuff. <clears throat> Good point about the same power plant, but being larger means it's slower. Yeah. Not to sound condescending, but that's how math works. <laughs> The equations don't lie. If you hold everything else constant but change one thing, the outcome has to change. Okay. I'm closing in toit. Toit like a toiger. 102 Sierra 1. Let's freaking do it. <clears throat> no duck, no lair. Oh, God. Okay. On sonar, new contact bearing. 270. Designated Sierra 1. Con sonar new contact bearing three three seven designated Sierra two. Con sonar new contact bearing two five November four, A. Designated Sierra three. As in E H and not dash Con A. Con sonar new contact bearing three one one designated Sierra four. I saw her that choppy at frickin' five knots. I guess it was with the permit too. Three knots. Yeah, uh, this might be like a fishing boat or something. Moichen. Con sonar Sierra two is classified. <laughs> Moichendizing. Con maneuvering, making turns for three knots. Con sonar Sierra three is classified as merchant. Okay, we got no one November ski. No layer, huh? It's pretty calm out here. That's uh. Surprising. Commission July 69. Argue the same power plant could be pushed harder. Yeah, I don't know how that works with like, uh, they're all like the same number, like whatever the heck it is, like S5W. Same, like, reactor number. I don't know if they, uh, do, like, marks or iterations on that or something. Mm. This one might be a fishing boat. Sonar Sierra Four is classified as merchant. All right, well, we're picking up guy. Good. We can. We don't need to putz around at five knots here. Make turns for seven. <clears throat> the sturgeon always looks uh, to the. Uh oh. Oh god, I thought I was gonna crash. <laughs> I don't know why that was so laggy. I've been getting a bug lately where in Windows Explorer, when I go into a folder, it no matter how I have the f folder like set to view, whether it's like large icons or like detailed list, it goes to detailed list and then runs through the items in the list and like each one disappears until it gets to the bottom and then it like all loads in. I feel like I've had that bug before, but I'm not sure what's causing it, but it's uh, it makes like each folder change like take a second or two and it's very annoying. So I don't know if that's related or not. <clears throat> 77 dB. Oh, yeah, it's quiet as hell. Quiet as hell. Okay, let's check out what we're done. What we're dealing with with CR1 here. Let's get some, some turning and burning here. See how that solution responds. Oh yeah, okay. Turn to port. Seems to like it. Oh, that's what I was going to say before this went away. Oh, well, I guess I can't really show too much, but the sturgeon is actually a little bit longer than the permit, but the sail is much larger than on a permit. If you put them like side by side, like the, uh, the Fairwater plane location is almost the same, so like the Permit sale would be more like this. And then the sturgeon one's just a lot bigger. Uh, 
Okay, we're in a we're in a lead situation here. Alright, the solution's not doing too bad. I think we'll just hun hunker down. Wait for that to settle out. Maybe up it to nine knots here or something. This is going, it's going pretty fast. The distance is not closing, is the point of uh, what I'm trying to say here. Distance is opening. Uh oh, clicked out of the game. <clears throat> I did not make a little starting thing. That's probably fine. I'll do a mini one. Don't imagine this will be too long of an engagement unless he's got a friend somewhere that I have not heard. Okay, let's turn in. Come right to. He's holding each 15 knots. He's, he's going. He's going pretty quick. May want to match on him there. Con, but uh, we're we're heading course. for them boofles. Well, he's turning the starboard, so we might get in those boofles a little, a little closer, or a little sooner. <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> of you may notice that this microphone is now on the other side when it used to be over here. I used to have these monitors set up like this monitor here and then the other monitor to my right. But uh, over my right shoulder is the window AC, so like the window AC lets more sound in from outside and we live right on a busy road. So I moved Constant this monitor over contact. here Sierra so then this three, microphone can be two, five, three, like perpendicular contact, to that window to, to not pick up as much as that road sound. And uh, it just it just feels better in here, just like having the monitor over here, because the wall is right here, and then it's more open over here, so it just kind of like blocked you off. But it's a good cho good choice. Oh, I'm sure it's still <laughs> I'm sure it's still easy too. That was on purpose. Okay, let's uh, Come right expedite three, soonest. Zero. Helm, I. I'll be coming back to port a little bit. <clears throat> no. Con, Helm, steady course. Maybe ever so slightly. Did he slow down briefly there and I didn't notice? No. For my lack of paying attention ass, sometimes I wish the game would be a little more like uh, contact, blah, blah, slowing, turning, whatever. <laughs> but I feel like that would just indulge my laziness or lack of paying attention rather, I should say. But that's why they're there. One person can't do it all. The crewman, that is. Okay, we are in there. 
like swimwear, as they say. Make turns for one, five knots, maneuvering eye. Alright, we're trying to get on this center line here, and then uh, we have to speed up to catch up with with dude. Let's do something a little more like this. Come left to two, five, eight, helm eye. Uh, let's go 400, just to make sure I'm not going to cavitate a full here. This wheel will be going the full. Con, helm, steady course. It looks like the... Uh the light shining this in the shadow kicks in at about 100 meters. It looked like it was at around 330 feet, which is about 100 meters. These are the things that my brain pays attention to. Granted, we are in his baffles, but I don't want to cavitate just in case there's a friend out there we haven't seen. Make turns for two, zero knots, maneuvering eye. So we're going to have to play catch-up. Con maneuvering, making turns for two, zero. 301 plus. Okay, got it. Roger, roger. <laughs> oh, forgive me, Father, for I've sinned. Why does the highlighted tab like pop out and become shadowy? I feel like it should be the other way around. Everything else is shadowy and then the selected one pops in. I guess I could change that if I wanted, if I really wanted to. <laughs> it makes no difference. All right, we need to keep a close eye on CR1 here for for slowdowns or turns, but he is just like straight line in it. Isn't time to intercept basically just this range, but at five knots instead? Does that sound logic? I don't know. I think so. Yeah, relative speed and all. So. On the order of like 40 minutes. Okay, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to speed it up. <laughs> I didn't want to just in case he changes course or speed, we'll just have to be paying. Very close attention to it. Con sonar, Sierra 3 is cavitating. Hope he's cavitating, coming out of his baffles. Let's slow down to 15. One, <clears throat> five knots, maneuvering eye. Make, make turns for five knots, maneuvering eye. Crazy, they call it Crazy Ivan. Con maneuvering, making turns for. It's the catch. Knots. Catch is about this big, doesn't stop on a dime. If we're too close, we'll drift right into the back of him. I need to like go in the text files and change that maneuvering typo. <laughs> it's, it's been there for six years and has bugged me the whole time. <laughs> Yvonne November.
He slowed down, but he like blipped the throttle first. It's like he hit the gas instead of the brakes. It's like, oh god. Yeah, why not? Don't make it easy for him. <laughs> uh, we aren't, our solution is doing very little at the moment. I guess just in case he got a whiff of me, it should be, uh, okay, we should be all good now. Minus three on the passive in case he did pick me up. Even though it's like, <laughs> we picked up a Sturge and now he's gone now, let's uh, just keep freaking running around. <clears throat> Local elderly man drives the naval vessel through gas station. <laughs> Hello, Netbug. <laughs> Ran 15 feet away from Jason. <laughs> Hello? Anyone there? Let's just uh, speed it up here. Let's kind of, I Con guess, sonar, lost I don't really need to close Zero with him two, as much. Bearing. But Zero, he seems to be, one, yeah, he's, he's, he's coming back this way. Yeah, so we want to get out of his way a little Con bit here. Regained contact on Sierra four bearing Zero, one, four. Oh, is he done now? Uh, it seems to be done now. Contact Sierra four last bearing zero one zero. Contact is in the baffles. Fwen, hello. Good evening. Yes, uh, for the latecomers, this is the new stream time. Moving forward, going back to Friday streams. Four bearing zero zero nine. It's a bit too hectic of a Sunday to stream as late in the day as I do on Sunday with dinner and everything coming up, so this is much better. Even though it's not not like how it used to be when I got off two hours early. Stream's starting like 90 minutes later, but I will take it. New campaign indeed, yes, we're in a lower, lower difficulty setting. Because uh, I just really want to beat 68. I've started this campaign so many times and haven't beaten it. And it is, it is, uh, truthfully more difficult than 84. And, uh, the random number gods blessed us with a sturgeon, selected the boat for us in the boat lottery at the beginning of the stream there. So we're, uh, we're good to go. First mission we're tracking in November here seems to be a solo, solo Vember. Make turns for one, zero, not maneuvering eye. Just did some crazy Ivan Come stuff. Right two, two, six, now we're trying four, to get back into position. Nine. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra three last bearing two four nine contact faded. I wonder what the permit noise level was. Probably like one two five. Con helm steady So course. five dB. It's a good chunk. <clears throat> I did. I got bull, bull hockey, <laughs> whatever. Hedgehogged. It was fine for that whole, that whole freaking mission, and then I got freaking bullseyed at max range. Those hedgehogs are ridiculous. CBA Grand Admiral. Hello, Admiral. Okay, he seems to be steady now. Let's crank it. Start smashing some atoms here. Isn't that like awesome? Like we're freaking, well, in the video game, but you know, we're smashing atoms to plow through this water. That's amazing. That's awesome. 
maneuvering, making turns for two, zero knots. I got my hands on the time lapse button and also the Rick for Ultra Kawhi button just in case C <laughs> goes freaking crazy again. Uh, we don't need this anymore and we can probably tighten it up a bit. Come left two, two, four, zero. Helm I. <clears throat> uh, I'll probably go to like two or three thousand yards before we shoot. These torpedoes are still dinky. I'm still on whichever version of dot mod I was on. Has there been a later version? I did mean I did want to like look into that before starting, but forgot. <sighs> yeah, I, I, I need to I need to badly get some like kneeboard type stuff going on here. Some quick reference things. Cause how many times I'm like what? What is it? What's that number again? Has he been doing like a very slight turn to port? Yeah, he has. It's very odd. Like one degree rudder. Can I see it on his model? I don't even know if like on their models you can see their rudders or not. Can't remember, honestly. Okay, let's just head for that. Come left intercept two, point, two, two, eight, even though our nine. angle is so shallow, it doesn't make too much of a difference. Con, sonar, lost contact. Sierra, four. Con, helm, psh, steady course. Psh, 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 psh. Okay, if he slows down, that doesn't matter. It's if he changes course. That's what matters here, mostly. Changes course and slows down. Slows down, the course he's doing, we're still in the baffle, so we need to watch for course changes. Okay, we're about halfway there. Go to 2,000 yards if we can't help it. Because we have to slow down the launch. We'll do a proper launch so we don't have to go crawl slow, but I don't want to launch a Mark 37 at 15 knots. I think they cruise at 17 or something. Well, should probably be fine in theory, but it's still sketchy. <laughs> All right, let's redo this course a little bit. Come right to two, four, zero, helm I. What the heck does the F10 button do? I just wanted to press F10, but now I don't want to because I'm scared. I want to do. Well, now I want to check. <laughs> what does F10 do? Do anything? Oh, hide HUD. Okay. I got a cough button on my little stream manager now, so I don't need to <laughs> turn my head. Just press the cough button. Meets the microphone. Oh, if he does a turn now, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> Get in there! Come left to... Two, three, he's, one. Helm, he's, he's slightly gyrating Con, and wiggling. Helm, Very slight course. course changes. Alright, and we are... There. Come left. Make turns for one, zero, knots. Maneuvering eye. Okay, we're launching a starboard tube, correct, correct. Still a little far, but I think it's fine. Uh, we, we'll turn it on. Con, helm, steady course. Fire! Los! Okay, set the passive, enable.
ascend this bad boy a little bit. You know what? I maybe you should play truthful to, truthfully to Mark Thirty Sevens. Once they go active, the wire stops doing anything. So maybe we should do that. <clears throat> Positive net energy gain from a fusion experiment. Oh yeah, that's just like to show that we can do it in a not bomb. Uh, that was at the National Ignition Facility out in Lawrence Livermore, and that place does like I think it, it's its main primary goal is like nuclear weapons research, so you don't have to actually like blow up a bomb to see what kind of yields you can get from a, a nuclear bomb and such. But it's not nothing, but it's not. It's not a. I, d I don't think the national ignition facility method of getting energy out of fusion is the way that we will generate electricity because it's like you have to put like a little sample in like the center of like this array of enormous laser beams that focus all their energy on this tiny point. It's not very. How do you get the energy out of that? How do you reload it? Uh, I think the tokamak, which is the donut of plasma, is still probably the better method, but that still has a long way to go. Why does the death in a mission end the entire campaign? I think you can die like once or twice, but then the death I did ended the campaign. Just because uh, the Soviets won. It's because I was doing so poorly, I guess. <laughs> Torps are already shit enough. <laughs> okay. That is fair. Dual dual swirling collider fusion reactor thingy. What? <laughs> oh, I hope one torpedo is enough. I didn't think about that. Maybe I should have launched two. I guess it's not too late. Let's just do it. <clears throat> Come right to two, three, nine, Helm I. How many times have I attempted the 68 campaign? I think the last go was... I guess, I mean, I guess it depends how many times... Do Are we counting, like, times the campaign has ended or, like, discrete chunks in time where I'm actively going after it? I'm gonna say that was, like, the third try. Of reactor that makes electricity directly without water under turbines. I don't think I'd heard of that, no. I don't stay too much on top of the cutting edge theoretical reactor stuff. I work in the world of uh, established technologies or soon to be established. Haven't even made it a ten because you know you'll lose. That's why you'll lose with that attitude. <laughs> but I guess to go back to fusion, fusion will be great whenever it happens, but you can't bank on it happening anytime soon. And fission is so much safer than I don't know how I don't know how many people think it's uh, particularly unsafe, but it's like airplane crashes. You get like very uh 
very big news story. Fear, fear. I don't want to say fear mongering, but it's just uh, it's like, it's like an airplane crash. You know, it's this huge event where a lot of things can go wrong at once. How okay? How fast is this guy gonna go here? Come left to but one eight two helm I. The amount of people that have died from nuclear is uh. There's less than like solar panels and, and wind turbines and such. People fall off roofs, people fall off those things. <clears throat> Come left. Make turns for two zero nine. Oh, he's going like frickin' flank. Come left to one three two helm I. So we need we need to keep up the fusion or fission. <laughs> keep up the fission. <laughs> Con maneuvering, making turns for two zero knots. Tyco says what's going on, man. <clears throat> Supposed to know everything. <laughs> yeah, nuclear's a big field. There's a lot of stuff to know in nuclear. Alright, this guy got hit with a frickin' torpedo. He's hurting bad, but he's making making a full flank bell still. Picking my ass up on active. Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. Come right to two, two, four, helm I. Ten thousand knots, Jesus. <clears throat> <clears throat> How big of a plane crash would you rate Chernobyl? I mean, it's the biggest by definition. Whatever the, uh... Steady course. What's that, like, Spanish island that begins with a T or the two 747s crash? It doesn't get worse than Chernobyl. Hopefully it never will. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. All right, how are we gonna do this here? Zero. Helm, I. You know what? Let's slow down. Let's Big just turn. give him a frickin' Five. spread. Fan up. it out or something. Try and get him stuck in the crosswind here. Cause he's frickin' full bore in my ass. Con sonar regain contact on Sierra 3 bearing. Con maneuvering making turns for 5 knots. Con fire control, we've lost the come right to three, four, four, helm I. Make turns for con sonar. We are cavitating. Con sonar, no longer <clears throat> cavitating. Con fire control, we've lost the wire. It may not even work, on, honestly. He might just sidestep it, but <laughs> need to try and get him uh come left to. One, three, seven, helm, I. Get him defensive so we can try and maneuver around here. Uh, I wanted to... Um, eh, indecision. I wanted to come around to the starboard. Con, torpedo room, two, three, ready. Do it. Do what most Zoe Day, how's it going? Cup of coffee, why thank you. I got the uh <laughs> I got the voice in there too. For your viewing pleasure. Tenerife, that's the name I was thinking of for the seven forty seven crash. Come left to Helm I. Mark 40, you have a snake search pattern. Uh, yeah, it does. I'm not sure if dot mod got rid of that or something, but there's there's an option you can do Con, straight run room, two, or four, snake. Con, helm, steady course. Ah, I should have had those torpedoes activate sooner. 
Oh, this guy got an acquisition over here. Let's throw some fire on this on this melee here. Throw some fuel on this fire. I don't know what the hell I said. Throw fire on the melee. <laughs> Come left two, two, three, two. Helm I. Is someone pinging from behind me? Or is that just the November I'm picking up here? Oh god, he's close. Con, fire control, weapon countermeasure homing. Let's do this. Two, two, three. Aye, sir. And this. Let's try and bracket him bracket him in here. Come just frickin' one. launching Mark 37s four, like two, it's frickin' zero, Halloween zero, here. Not maneuvering eye. Make depth five zero zero feet, die by. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Yeah, I'm not sure when the Mark 48 got like the uh, ESA style seeker head to use an Con, airplane no, term. If that's how it works. Con, I'm sure earlier five, versions zero, zero, may not have had. There's been a lot of Mark 48 versions is all I'm trying to say. May not have been all of them. Oh, God. I messed up that lack Con, of double torpedo control, nonsense. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra, one, last bearing, three. Oh, I just lost him in the baffles. Oh, my God. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Sonar regained contact on. Sierra, one, bearing, three, one, eight. Oh, is he actually being smart? He's just running away in a line. He's not trying to <laughs> turn. Oh, there he goes. Just deciding to turn for no reason. Con helm, steady course. Oh, you know what? I, I know what I need to do. I remembered from a previous time. We got a wire guy to torp in. He goes faster than the torpedoes, which is which is the problem. <laughs> Forgot that he might need the old double tap earlier. Could have gotten him in one fell swoop, but okay, he's turning because he's dumb. He could just run in a straight line and be like, "Bye." Conditions could hardly be more ideal. <laughs> Stop countermeasure homing. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. Yeah, keep on coming, mate. Right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, where's my torp? Oh, God. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing three, two, six. Con Kaboom. sonar, All right. Sierra, one, last bearing three, two. Pergosioning. <laughs> How's it going, Zozo down under? Mechanically Con trained seeker since the 70s. Wow, okay. Three, last bearing, two, four, the cost nine, of the torps who fired exceeds the cost of a November. That is one metric, but how, how much shipping could this November sink? Vostok Gundam, hello. 
Good, how are you doing? Con, helm, steady course. Oh yeah, cold waters is a... Uh, does not require as much of your time as a simulator. You can get in and get out with the mission pretty easily. Especially in 84. 68 is a... Uh, hard mode. As they say up here in Boston. It'd take me a while to get used to that cough button. Seal missions are long. That is correct. <laughs> Pack the car. Get in the car. Yeah, except nobody but nobody but us knows you're a freaking cop. You're the test subject for a new layout. I've not seen any any new layout, nor heard anything. But I don't I don't pay too much attention to what YouTube tells me. I still need to get my fiance to watch The Departed. It's like uh, <laughs> the modern day intro to Boston. <laughs> Alright, let's just steam on out of here till we freaking uh, those torpedoes blow up or we get them far enough away or whatever. That's his torpedo still chugging along out there. Look at that. This thing just got stuck doing donuts back there very well. Mm. And we're done. Cha Chang, all that for one victor, one hour. I'll meet you in one hour. You're in Prague? One hour. That was not your objective, son of a bitch. I used all my torpedoes. Now I'm gonna miss my objective. I should have switched out for, I, yeah, I should have switched out for all Mark 37s and it was a freaking uh, ASW mission. And get some of these things off my boat. This mission, they should somehow make it so, like, any submarine you sink that comes through your, your way is, is, like, maybe a secondary objective. It was maybe not the primary objective, per se, but it should really just be, like, sink all sons of bitches. Maybe I should get some R forty fives. I guess they're the uh they're like the freedom variant. There's like a Mark forty five freedom export torpedo, just without the nuke. <laughs> Be an actual Halsey order. <laughs> that's a uh that's an Ellis quote from Left 4 Dead 2. Is what that is. <laughs> Sounds like something Patton might say too. Weak duct, weak layer, okay. 339 Sierra Un. Con sonar lost contact. Last bearing 316. Contact faded. Oh, noisy, eh? Oh, it's a bit noisy, I hear ye. Just doing all the accents today, ain't we? 
This one was going a bit slower. I can't remember if it was going slower than November on the overmap. Maybe this is Diesel's. Just a good and a bad thing. They're slower, but they're quieter. All right, let's get beneath that layer. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Slow down. Make turns for Tune it up. Maneuvering up. Might as well head for where we got that last contact. Come right to three, three, nine. Helm I. Con maneuvering, making turns for three knots. Enable debug mode, you can see the target highlighted in orange and green. Yeah, they should be a bit more specific with that. It's just like, here, guess what your target is and waste your weapons on things that are not your target. Maybe I should do that just to get through these missions because they're a bit of a slog. But since we're in a lower difficulty, I think we progress through the campaign a bit faster. The restream bot is worse. I, I even like resynced up Twitch. I'm not sure. What's going on with that? I think it's out of my control. But I can, uh, I should at least, like, tell them or something. <laughs> Mark 45 is a weak warhead. Hey, if it's easier to get hits, well, and then you gotta make sure the wire doesn't snap, so. I don't know. Is Mark 45 supposed to be for surface boats? What is it supposed to be for in the game? Con, dive at two, zero, zero feet. I guess still ASW. 225 warhead. It's the same warhead as the Mark 37, so yeah. Still gonna take two bad boys, but things will get things will happen faster. <laughs> so yeah, maybe we should start taking some for these nuke boats. At least make the get in behind them and stay there. Kind of shots a bit more palatable. Not the 68 USA, yeah, I'm frickin' Mark 37. <laughs> With how much, like, stuff was going on in early Cold War, it surprises me that there wasn't a speedier effort to get a faster ASW torpedo, but I think it's just because everything was nuclear. It's just like, nuke them. I had the Mark 45. I want more context on the, that early Cold War doctrine and posture. Am I getting FPS steps? Sunk a victor because he hit the propeller, sunk below collapse steps. Hell yeah, that's awesome. I don't think anyone says FTW anymore. <laughs> you know what people don't say anymore is pwn. Remember pwn? Pure pwnage. Okay, let's uh speed it up this way. Make turns for nine knots. Maneuvering eye. Do some hops, dear. I'm gonna go four, 12 nine, knots actually. Make turns for one, two knots, maneuvering eye. Shut up, I already ate dinner. Talking to my cell phone alarm. <laughs> yeah, Elite Speak does not exist anymore. I don't know what them kids say and them doters and battle bots and battle bits or whatever. I was thinking about trying out battle bit. That's like that Minecrafty looking Battlefield 2 kind of thing. But just never did. Con, dive at two five zero 
Speed die by. Pound is ageless. <laughs> Bet cap Riz. <laughs> yeah, I've heard bet and Riz. I don't, maybe I've heard cap without realizing it. Battle Toads. No, it's called like Battle Bit or something. Yeah, it's just called Battle Bit. Developers, Sergeant Okie Doki, what? <laughs> that's like a that's a that's a player handle. That's not a that's not a studio name. First, uh, first slow down and listen. Let's see. Can't find no submarines. I'm guessing this is diesel boats because we haven't heard nothing so far. Is that the active intercept? It's like offset. Nothing down here. Let's just come, uh... No, let's go... Mm. Yeah, let's come, uh, left 90. Port 90. Come left to 2, 5, 5. Helm, I. Make turns. Expedite port. this One, turn here. Zero knots. Maneuvering I. Millie. <laughs> Millie Vanilli. <laughs> Born in 97, you're a, a Zoomer, as they say. Gen Z. Oh my, oh my god, love to get in a boomer, wow. That'd be the SS Cougar. <laughs> On helm, steady course. Make turns for, make turns for three knots, maneuvering eye. The reason I was hesitant to like make this turn earlier is because I do want to go shallow and check up there, but I can turn down here first and then turn back up there. I says Cougar's a gilf. Ugh. <laughs> Cougar's not a gilf. <laughs> I don't want to say the other one. Slack a bunch, <laughs> bunch of a bunch of slack jawed pile of sticks. Or slack jawed cigarettes, something. <laughs> Predator, Jesse Ventura. Okay, I'm thinking, I'm thinking our first 
scratch and sniff as a bust here. Come right to three, three, nine, helm I. <laughs> Just like me. <laughs> Going active. <laughs> well, uh, I'll get to the third scratch and sniff spot first, and then we'll we'll go active. They hand me down nuke boats. Oh yeah, that's supposed to be in like what, seven years or something. I forget the exact day. Date. Dive at one zero zero feet. Dive by. Yeah, I hope it's only a matter of time till Australia gets some some nuclear power generation too. I think you guys got pretty big uranium reserves down there. This is, uh, yeah. Let's get back down there. Make depth two, five, zero feet, die by. Make turns for one, zero knots, maneuvering eye. Con, maneuvering. That line Make will always stand out for me. Yeah, it's a freaking. <laughs> it's a weird ass line. <laughs> Dylan, you son of a bitch. What's the matter? CIA got you pushing too many pencils? JK, how's it going? <laughs> Jesse Ventura. He's the mine now. I, I think his, uh, well, it's probably many people's favorite line, but when he's like, I ain't got time to bleed. What's his face? is like, huh, hey, okay. <laughs> Got banned from Twitch again. Jeez, what are you doing? What are you doing with your life? Come left to two five two helm I. Con maneuvering, making turns for. Make turns for five. Make turns for seven knots, maneuvering I. The, uh, the increase in noise at, at the speed down here always felt not correct to me. Just because I know, I know drag goes up, like, to the cube or whatever. So I feel like noise from that would be similar, It'd be pretty flat for a while. And you just, like, hit a wall and it just kind of just starts exponentiating. But five or seven knots is, I think, too slow for that. But whatever. It's fine. Make turns for three knots. Maneuvering eye. Just don't lead him so much. Oh, God. <laughs> Con maneuvering. <clears throat> 
three knots. And my favorites will always just be like what Arlie Army says in Full Metal Jacket, because it's just so uh, outlandish. <laughs> Something, something, suck the chrome off a trailer hitch, suck a golf ball through a garden hose, some good stuff there. <laughs> Con, helm, steady course. Make depth one, zero, zero feet, die by. Nothing about Nerbam's correct. <laughs> yeah, I'm putting too much thought in it. The TMA isn't even, like, uh, understandable in this game. Let's start turning. Come right to three, four, four, helm. Ah, uh, screw the three nozzles. Let's do five. It's just too slow. Takes forever to turn. Maneuvering eye. <laughs> we ain't found shit. <laughs> <clears throat> oh yeah, the stunned early army, that's great. What the fuck is that? What are you doing with a jelly donut? We need to be like, have a friend sub in this game, but like... Ping them, but then like listen like far away when <laughs> Lord Helmuth is blasting in that guy's ear with the megaphone, and then yell into the guys off the dune. <laughs> Think we're being too literal? I oh, said, "Come the desert," so we're combing it. The last good Mel Brooks movie. <laughs> okay, let's secure from this crap. We got one more scratch and sniff. One more scratch and sniff spot. I'm just like kind of subconsciously going in the right direction. They should be going like southwesterly. But who knows if they are or not. Make turns for one, zero, not. Make turns for one. Con sonar. Arr, we are Con sonar, no longer cavitating. Con helm, steady course. Ah, uh, okay. Contact well, bay. that's one way Three, to find people. Zero, two, designated Sierra one. Con sonar, Sierra one is classified. Yeah, we're both outside of summary. active range. <laughs> Come left to. Three zero con sonar launch transient from Sierra one. He is not three point nine kiloyards away. Con, okay, well, we might as well launch. Sure. Oh. Come right to three three one helm I. Shoot two one, I sir. Shoot two two, I sir. Con helm, steady course. Glad to have you, JK. Yeah, Colar is just uh, yeah. I get it's more realistic in the sense that you're acting more like a captain and not doing everything but uh that is the appeal of dangerous waters is doing all the things <laughs> we seem to sweep the desert <laughs> Uh, 
But there's a lot of that in Cold Waters that's like kind of a. Not really even like approximated, but just like. Well, I don't know about a lot, but the, the big gripe for me is like TMA. TMA does not behave like it should in this game. Or rather, the act of maneuvering your boat to, pro to promote quicker solution building. <laughs> we have to slow down first. Or someone else. Come right to zero one three helm I. Stop this thing. We can't stop. My brains are going into my stomach. Oh my god, hello. Where the heck did you come from? Got yeah, a little faster than I thought it would. Passing 300 feet. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra 2. Last bearing 3, 4, 5. Con passing 400 feet. Con sonar no longer cavitating. Passing 500 feet. Con sonar passing 600 feet. Passing 700 feet. Come right to one, six, three. Torpedo oh, frickin' nine. sucks. <laughs> oh god. Got so lucky. Con torpedo room tube one ready. Didn't even pick up my frickin' countermeasure. Make depth five, zero, zero feet, die by. Make turns for one, five knots, maneuvering eye. Con maneuvering, making turns for one, five knots. Fighter pilots sound like they're talking a little too much, <laughs> if that's the case. Okay. Come left to three, three, four, helm I. Ooh. Whiskey got uh, torpedoes. Torpedoes inbound. Inbound and hat. Make turns for five knots. Maneuvering I. Okay, we got something to the north. Right I think zero, Sierra One's zero, nine, likely nine. dealt with. It's someone up this way. Steam for them. Con maneuvering, making turns for one zero knots. Con, dive at five, zero, zero feet, dive by. Con, fire control, weapon countermeasure homing. Con, helm, steady course. Oh my god, that guy is a loser, Tychosis. <laughs> G14 classified. <laughs> what is that from? Ah, oh, that sounds so familiar. 
What is that from? Rush hour, that's it. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> higher res oh if you just if you want dangerous waters to feel like it's higher res just play 688i for a while <laughs> dangerous waters is freaking 8k compared to that I don't interact much with the sub community anymore except with you guys streaming. Pretty, pretty loner. Which I think is how, which is I think ref somewhat reflective of the real submarine community. <laughs> Yeah, I want to try fast attack. I don't want to have more uh, more time to dedicate it. Dedicate to it. Bob made it sound like it's a. Uh... Oh, hey, there you go. A bit. Uh... It'll uh, it'll bite you if you're not paying attention there. Oh, we got a bearing on Sierra too. Just kind of heading the way I thought it was. <clears throat> Controls all like DW since the fifties. Yeah, it's a point I I, I get kind of broken recordy on, but DW is not made to be the, not even like it's not really even made to be like accurate per se. It's just like uh, it just kind of gets across like the uh, it's meant for like midshipmen at like the Naval Academy or such, like to get like familiarized with how sub submarine combat goes. It's like. You get the functional representation of how things work, but it's not, it is not a, uh, a study sim or something like a, like a DCS where they're trying to recreate it perfectly. It's just the, uh, not to talk down to it, but it's just like, it's, just all we have there's so that's where like modern naval warfare is gonna like it's gonna blow your socks off <clears throat> oh don't worry about it jk i need another beer too <laughs> all right speaking of which i'll be right back 